Meet the new faces and rising voices of Alberta's musical landscape, featuring performances from the Command Sisters, Samantha Savage Smith, Ruben in the Dark, Act natural. Act natural. <laughs> the Command Sisters are, we are singer-songwriters. We love using our music to inspire and um, just heal people and we just, we love music and we love each other. Performing is probably one of the best feelings in the world. Going on stage and sharing something that you love so much with other people and looking into the audience and seeing that people are enjoying it. It's like, you can't get any better than that. When you say that you, you're not sure if you should give it all just to fall back hard. You've been hurt and you know the pain cause you've felt the break of a broken heart. I won't promise forever, but I can promise I'll never walk away. Even if the world tries to fake me, or anybody ever tries to take me, I won't stop. The storm's rolling, I'll fight anything that comes our way And wherever this journey takes us, well, nothing's gonna make me lose my faith Ruben Bullock and I'm from Calgary, Alberta. It's a funny thing being on a stage by yourself. It's really intimidating. Like it's, you can't engage the same way with somebody you don't know. I know I'm blue 
sky if you feel like letting up. The tenderness you tucked away. You talk about what they might say. Why have I found your following? Well, you are autumn now, the leaves are brown you borrowed from the spring. Tucked away, you talk about what they might say. Why have I found your following? Well, you are autumn now, the leaves are brown, you borrowed from the spring. My name is Samantha Savage Smith, and I am a songwriter, a singer, and a guitar player, and a bartender. <laughs> My dad is, he's an old rocker, and he plays guitar, and he loves the Stones and the Beatles and all that. And I lived around Cochrane, my dad lived in Calgary, and we decided I'd take guitar lessons from him every Wednesday, and it was just a good excuse for him to come out to Cochrane and to hang out and teach me some tunes. So that's when it all started. That's when the playing started.
The best way to show your stuff off is to play a live show for someone who's never heard you, and then they'll buy your record and <laughs> follow you from there on, you know? And like, and playing shows too is just, uh, on a personal level, it's a way of developing as a musician and you get ideas from it, you improve your craft, it's awesome. I love touring, it's like, it's hard, but it's great. Came by for some batteries You try to make love to me I would be so easy I, I music never, is <laughs> music is everything. Like, I always loved it when I was younger. It was like my hobby, it was my favorite thing to do ever. And you don't realize till you're older, I just got um, a message from a friend just about a couple months ago, and they're like, What would your life be without music? And I looked at that, what he said, and I, I thought about it for like a week, I swear. And like, I, I'm still thinking about it. It's like, What would my life be completely if we didn't do music? And it's crazy how it's so much involved in my life and I literally can't imagine doing anything else. Took a breath and walked up to the door Fade to smile just like the night before and I don't know why I came All the
forget that smell I took my breath away on that cold December night Now your name repeats in my mind all the time But when I looked into your eyes Since then nothing's There's no like manufactured mystique in this band. I mean, there's the one thing that there is with it is there's like a duality involved with a lot of different stuff. I mean, um, some of our our brightest songs are like coming from the darkest places. And uh, with me, like lyrically, I mean, that's kind of what the whole project is about. Like, it's very much about the writing. The songs are my demons as much as they are my like uh, achievements, you know. And and so it just it all it all it all fits. Try not to try This fire I've seen before you and I I've seen it all before Through a crack in the wall of umbilical cord Hide your love inside my head Truth is, I've tried Oh, to be the only thing on your mind And I'm trying to change But you cut like a cold shoulder blade Hide your love inside my head
I've been with like so many great musicians and I live with a house full of musicians and because of this it's just like really great opportunities to learn off of them. I don't know, it's just it, that's like it's a, one of the helpful things and I think you know my songwriting even up until now for the new like this new record it's like, just a lot more complex and a lot more thought into it. And it's good to feel like I'm always more stoked about the next song I write like it's exciting because it's, you know, I, if I sense that it's better and it's kind of going further than what I've already done, then I feel like I'm doing something right. I see the skyline, the passing of road signs, then the truth struck me, to drove into the city that I need you. community that I'm involved in for sure is really inspiring like in Calgary there's there's 
just so many great musicians and bands, and the landscape definitely plays a part in songwriting. I think there's a lot of um, kind of like landscape references in a lot of songs I write, which I would imagine are just kind of streaming from my environment and all that. I like Alberta, I like being close to the mountains and trees and lakes and, you know. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a nice place. It definitely has its like inspiring kind of moments. I wrote a song for the ones that I remember Memories lament all the lovers I have met. Well, I wrote a song for the ones that I forget. And take these dreams from me. Well, I don't need an easy way now. And they're just dragging my body. Around. Will I buried my brother? I buried my lover. I buried my head in my hands. And you said all of my burdens are too much to bear, and your fingers through my. I wanted you to stay with me You come from the forest, I bet With hair as long as the sunset And you come from the forest, I bet with a soul as good as a hunter's guess When I was younger than you Well, I saw through these wicked ways It's another bill that time will pay Did you to stay with me? Who knew you'd be leaving me for dead? We're kind of at the at the last stages of finishing the recording of our new record. Now we have a label that is going to be kind of helping us out with all that. They're called Arts and Crafts. It's really like a, the, a dream label for us. They're very well established. Their roster is really tight, and they're known as like a very selective kind of company. I feel lucky to be in the situation that we're in and I think that's like an important part of it, you know, to like to have that kind of feeling um, because it's really motivating to to be like, all right, you're taking a chance on me. Um, you know, just like we're, let's let's do this right. Our relationship ha as uh, sisters has uh, definitely influenced our music. I mean, having somebody there is, like, I couldn't imagine being on stage without my sister. Like, I would feel alone. Like, I'm always, I can look at her and I can interact with her and smile. And then if you're feeling kind of, like, in a bad mood or just, like, scared, like, you know, there's the audience to connect with, but then there's something really special about having somebody that you're so close to on stage with you. And then, of course, she adds so much more sound to the songs that I write.
I kind of have like the singer songwriter roots, you know, where like I am telling stories and I am, but on stage it's, it's, it doesn't it doesn't feel like that at all. It feels just like playing music, I think. And I kind of you know, I'm not, I'm not trying to tell somebody anything. I'm not, I don't have anything to prove, and I don't have. I'm not trying to teach or or even even share really. You know, it's it's kind of its own its own thing. You want me out of your heart. I can't find my way out This winter's widow was my lover and my stranger I swore I'd never try to run Hurry through my heartache Well, in a letter I once was Married in a garden So my heart has a
it's so important for us to give back to um, people because we've been given so much. People have believed in us and people have given us opportunities when, even when we were younger, when we were starting out, people have been so supportive. It still blows my mind how supportive Edmonton has been in our own community. So it feels definitely great to go and help others. And music is so strong and music is so empowering that you can really touch people. So it's, it's stuff like doing that just makes you, wow, this is why we're doing music. We're making people happy with our music. about Calgary and I think even Alberta like Edmonton I, it's the same deal the community is a lot tighter it's smaller 
it's a, it's easier to actually have these sort of things like you live in a house and have your jam space in the basement and all live close together and it be affordable and that you can pursue these things. There's really great momentum happening in this city right now and you can feel that people are getting more excited about it. It's not just about oil and it's not just about making the big bucks. It's like there's a, a really a growing and strong community of artists, musicians, or fine arts, or whatever the case. I may have broke some hearts because I'm 